today I'm doing one of my favorite videos that I get to shoot every few weeks. I have a total of, I think, five packages and letters here that were actually sent to me from you, my subscribers, my viewers, my supporters. So thank you so very much to each and every person who honestly reaches out, emails me, contacts me, sends me packages in the mail, packages of support, words of encouragement, items that mean something to you to pass off to me, giving me items that are that will go into my personal collections, be it autograph collections or memorabilia or toy collections. It's it's everything I get is very much appreciated and I think it's so cool that the reach that my channel has is just I never expected this. You know what I'm saying? This is just awesome. So I've got a total, I think, like what, two boxes, two mailers, and two letters. So actually there's six things here. And I don't think anything is actually outside the US this time, but uh, I think everything is from inside the US. So a lot of people always ask me, hey Clint, we want to send you an item to promote our business. Or, hey, Clint, I'm a huge supporter of your channel. I would like to send you just something that I think you would like. And people ask for my address. So I always leave my UPS business address, um, like my UPS mailbox, in the, the description box to all my videos. And in this one, it is in the description box. There's no pressure Nobody has to send me stuff. I mean, it's not like you have to send me stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to say that it's it's expected, but the people who do, it's much much appreciated. It's it's awesome. So let's get started. I'm gonna quit rambling. Um, let's do a letter first. I do like to receive letters. This one is from um, some of the packages that I get. People contact me first and they say, please don't. You know, either say my name or location or something, and um, and then if I don't hear anything from the person, I will never tell on camera where you are located. You know what I'm saying, or your personal information. I would just just say name. You know what I'm saying. It's like this one came from Stephen Hodges. So Stephen Hodges, thank you so much. I have a letter sent from one of my supporters. So here we go. We got a few things in here. I went to a local Comic Con in my area. We have this once a year. I sent you some free stuff. I've been watching your videos now for six months and I've become a better person because of your videos. Thank you. Well, thank you, Steven. Have you been to any indoor amusement parks? I hear from a video that there is one in, in Indiana. Uh, actually, I think there are a couple in Indiana. I've been to indoor like water parks in Indiana, but amusement parks with like actual coasters and stuff. There are some. I'm not too sure where they are though. P.S. I've sent you info about an upcoming Marvel DC show. I will not be going because of work. P.S. I've been having a good time in my life. I've told others of your channel. Dragonfrogkickstarter.com. Issue number two. Pre-order now. Make sure to check out that website. CT's number one Comic Con. Terrific Con. Connecticut's number one Comic Con. August 9th, 10th, and 11th. They got all kinds of uh, celebrities and artists and personalities going to appear there. This one looks like it's in Massachusetts. So if you're in that area, you got all kinds of cons that you can attend and go to. And then here, he sent me a bookmark. Okay, cool. Thank you, Steven. I appreciate the letter. I appreciate the goodies. Next, let's do one of the packages. Um, let's do this. This one came direct from Amazon. Um, obviously, since it was uh, sent by Amazon, I don't know who actually who this came from, unless if they had Amazon put some kind of like a gift note in this. If they didn't, then I'm not too sure who it came from. The new Death Nut Carolina Reaper Peanuts. There is a Death Nut Challenge. Look at that. I will try that. 
here in the near future. I guess actually, I've already recorded it, but there is the, uh, oh, the Satan Toes Lollipop, which is the hottest lollipop in the world. Uh, what was the Scoville? What was it, like 6 million Scoville? It is incredibly hot. I've actually already recorded the video. I took the challenge, and it's epic. And that will actually be published on YouTube next Sunday. So I took the challenge of the world's hottest lollipop. We have to keep it in your mouth for five minutes. You can't take it out. You can't spit nothing. You've, you've got to take it for five minutes straight. Most people can take it for like a minute or two and they give up. How long did I last? Find out next Sunday. Whoever said this to me, there is no note in here. I don't know who said this to me, but um, thank you very much. Whoever sent me this challenge. This was sent to me by Time Kettle Tech. So it looks like this is actually sent to me by a company. So, I mean, I get packages from uh, viewers. I have lots of companies who watch me, who send me stuff, you know, because they want to promote their, um, per they want to promote their products, you know. Um, sometimes the companies, they reach out and they ask me if they can send me a package and sometimes they don't. And I actually don't know what this is. Yeah, I don't, I do not know what this is. This is a language translator device, supports 36 languages and 84 accents, voice translator, earbuds, wireless Bluetooth translator. Wow. That's crazy. So I was sent a language translator device, translates languages. So I'll make sure, and I will do a Amazon search. I will find this company. I'll make sure and put a direct link below in the description box, a direct link to this device, and you can check it out online on Amazon and see exactly how this thing works. It is this says it is a wearable translator. So it appears that you can actually you can wear this translator, and it translate. This is probably uh, I know some of the wearable translators you can like wear kind of like an AirPod and a person speaks and it translates it and it translates it right in, into your ear. So if the person's speaking Japanese, it, it'll translate it into English, like right into your ear. They're very cool. Like I've seen some of the reviews on items like this and it's, they're actually really cool. So I'm kind of intrigued by this actually. So yeah, very cool. I'll make sure to leave a direct link below in the, in the description box to this company. Language translator, wearable translator, awesome. So here's a letter from Louise Goman. Louise Goman, she actually sent me a, a treat box, which you saw on a past video. My wife and I right now are actually on the Nutrisystem, so we can't actually do the treat box yet. Um, that was like all, I recorded a couple of treat boxes before we actually went onto the Nutrisystem diet. And so I've got several munch packs recorded in some, I think I have one subscriber box that I got recorded like a month ago that I'm going to publish in the future. Um, so I've got several treat boxes that were sent to me from subscribers that um, the wife and I can't actually record yet at this time because we're on the Nutra system diet. We're trying to lose some weight. And while we're on this diet, we can't have candy and chocolates and sweets. So... Any packages are being put on hold for the time being, but they will still be recorded in the future. It might be a few months down the road, but every treat package that we get will get recorded still. Just we can't do it right now. So any in the next probably three to four months, any munch pack that you see or any treat box that you see published on my YouTube channel was actually recorded probably as far back as early May that me and her sat down and recorded probably half dozen videos over like a two week span to have like dueling treat challenge boxes recorded. So while we're dieting, we can still have some of those cool, fun videos to publish while we're doing our diet. You know what I'm saying? So uh, Louise, we still have your box. Um, we haven't done the recording yet. Yours is one of the ones that is still like in the slot that will get recorded and published once, 
once we're off of our diet, once we both hit our new goal weights. So um, Louise actually, she bought the same box for herself. And um, yeah, so she just wrote on here kind of uh, her views of the candy, her views of the treats. She challenged, uh, looks like herself and her roommate. It looks like Louise cheated and she, or she said that she cheated so they did a kind of a taste test she beat her roommate 89 to 86 and so they kind of like they rated treats in the box kind of like the rating this is actually really cool typed it out and they rated like what they felt of all the treat boxes but yeah she said that she ordered two boxes sent me one they kept one and that's actually how they felt about all the boxes so of the items in the box so that's awesome I got a package from tpublic.com, sent to me from tpublic. Oh, there we go. Cool packaging, though. The poly bags are fancy. Oh, fell out. Oh, that's cool. Got your, got your baby grill size. They actually made me my own t-shirt. You got your boy on it. That's cool. Yeah, I did not know that this was coming. <laughs> How cool is that? Well, thank you so much. Yeah, I did not know that this package was coming. Is there a letter in here or anything? Is there anything? Oh. So it did fall out. T Public, thank you for your order. Independent artist has been paid with your purchase. Huh. So it looks like tpublic.com must be some kind of a website with independent artists who create t-shirts, it looks like. I don't know which independent artist made this shirt for me. I have no idea, but thank you so much. Whoever made this for me on tpublic.com and had it sent to me, please reach out to me and let me know. Because I would love, love to find out. Because Thank you. That's awesome. That is so cool. Thank you. So we got one package left, one box. This was sent to me from Deborah Gray. And I've had, okay, this was shipped off May 23rd, so I've had this thing for a couple weeks now. Um, it kind of got shuffled around with some of my Amazon boxes because it's in an Amazon box. So it kind of got shuffled around with some of my Amazon stuff and I found it. And I was like, oh, this isn't an Amazon box. This is something from a subscriber. So that's my fault. That's my fault. But here we go from Deborah Gray. It came in mint condition to me. I hope it comes to you in the same. Deborah. There's the note from Deborah. And now we have a Funko Pop. Oh, cool. Jack Torrance. That is an awesome Funko Pop. That actually matches my downstairs office. You know, how I have the, uh, the huge poster behind me from The Shining. And yeah, she sent me the Jack Torrance Funko Pop. How cool is that? So yeah, everything that subscribers send me, I keep everything. I'll make sure and put this with the rest of the Funko Pops that I've received from subscribers, and I will be keeping this. How cool. Jack Torrance. That is neat. So thank you so much, Deborah. I really appreciate it. So that is what we got for today's kind of like a uh, my Monday mailbag. So uh, yeah, thank you so much everybody who sent me stuff, I really appreciate it. If you did send me a package or a letter or, or any kind of mail that wasn't in this video, don't worry. I actually have packages right now at my UPS mailbox that need to be picked up. Um, so the next mail day might have your package in the next video. So stay tuned for that and thank you to everybody who sent me stuff, people who send me stuff in the future. Thank you. Thank you everybody who watches me and I'll see you next time. I'm out.